Hi hello and welcome to my channel. You are with me in TNPSL tutorials. Today we are going to discuss about the fundamental rights which is given in the topic polity in TNPSC syllabus. Let us see one by one. Now the first one is right to equality. It covers article 14 to 18. In article 14, it has explained that equality before law and equal protection to law. And in article 15, prohibition of discrimination on grounds of religion, race, caste, sex or place of birth. Article 16 deals with equality of opportunity in matters of public employment. And article 17, abolition of untouchability and prohibition of its practice. Article 18 Abolition of titles except military and academic. Right to freedom. It is from Article 19 to 22. Article 19 says that protection of six right regarding freedom of speech and expression. Second one is assembly. Third one is association. Fourth one is movement. And fifth one is residence. And sixth one is profession. Article 20 deals with protection and respect of conviction for offenses. Article 21 deals with protection of life and personal liberty. Article 22. Protection against arrest and detention in certain cases. Right against exploitation. That is Article 23 and 24. Article 23 says that prohibition the traffic in human beings and forced to labor. Article 24 is prohibition of employment of children in factories etc. Then right to freedom of religion. Article 25 to 28. Article 25 deals with freedom of conscience and right to freely profess, practice and propagate any religion. Freedom to manage religious affairs. Article 27 deals with freedom from payment of taxes for promotion of any religion. Article 28 deals with freedom from attending religious instructions or worship in certain educational institutions. And then cultural and educational rights. That is Article 29 and 30. Article 29 says... Protection of language, script and culture of minorities. Article 30. Right of minorities to establish and administer educational institution. Then last one is right to constitutional remedies. That is Article 12, 32 and 35. Article 32 gives to the right to move the Supreme Court from enforcement of fundamental rights through the writs of habeas corpus, mandamus, prohibition, criteria and Q warranto. And Article 33 deals with it empowers the parliament to res restrict the fundamental rights of members of armed forces, paramilitary forces, police forces, intelligent agencies and analogs forces so as to ensure proper discharge of their duties and maintenance of discipline among them. Article 34 it provides for the res restrictions of fundamental rights while marital law is in force within the territory of India. Then Article 35 laid down the power to make law to give effect to specified fundamental rights. Thank you for watching this video. Support us by subscribing our channel. Like, share and comment. Thank you.